Okay, welcome. Uh, today we are going to talk about special products. So in this case, um, what are the, some of the products we're going to talk about? Oh, hold on one second here. Okay, that's better. Okay, sorry about that. Okay, so we're gonna start talking about special products. And these are the six special products that we're going to talk about in this class or in this uh, next few videos. Um, now, a lot of these video, a lot of these special products come from just using the distributive property and other basic um, operations. Okay, so again, these are the ones you're going to want to thoroughly memorize. You're going to want to know these and know how they're done. And by carefully studying these special products, you'll be able to recognize when they're to be used and to be able to use them quickly. Okay? Uh, for example, this is just the distributive property, right? This one is actually using the distributive property twice and then just uh, using basic operations to simplify it. Okay? And in fact, all of these are pretty much using the distributive property along with basic operations to simplify the expression. Uh, and again, just make sure you study them and study how they are created. So going this way and this way because there's an equal sign. So if you can recognize the form that these take, then you can see, oh, these factor a certain way. Or if you see that, oh, they match up with one of these uh, forms, then you say, oh, it must be this when we make the product or we expect you know, uh, take the product of the two, okay? So this is what we're gonna study and we're gonna do examples using these and we're gonna go from there. See you next time.